Good morning guys, welcome to my channel. It is a beautiful Sunday morning. It's not raining. We live in southwestern Pennsylvania and it has been raining non-stop. So it's just been rain, 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 rain. And it is not raining today. So I thought I would sit in front of the door and have some natural lighting because it looks great. And drink my coffee and do a makeup look. So here we go. First I'm going to go in with my e.l.f. putty primer, poreless putty primer. This is amazing stuff. If you don't have it, get yourself some because it's great. It was like $8 at Walmart, so that's what I'm going to put on my face. take my cover FX power play foundation and N20 my bird says hello take my loose setting power by Laura Mercier translucent powder and just set my under eyes here my going coconuts palette taking the shade shredded with that fake brush and just working that all over the lid And I'm going to go in with my Frozen 2 palette, Elsa, and go in with Fire. So I did this look yesterday, and, uh, I didn't film any of it, so I'm kind of recreating it because I loved it so much and I thought I should video it, so I'm kind of just recreating it. My family and I, we went out to um, Barnes & Nobles and we had lunch at the Crackle Bar Cracker Barrel and just had ourselves a nice time. It was Valentine's Day weekend, so it was really busy. We had a nice time and I didn't get any content, but I thought I would recreate this look today. And then at the end of this video, I'm going to show you the outfit I wore as well. Since I got, you know, some pictures of my makeup yesterday and the outfit, but I just didn't do a video. So I thought I would upload a quick video on how to create this look. Okay. And then I'm going to take a flat brush, spray it, and I'm going to go in with the Northern Lights. Pat that into the inner corners. Okay. 
And then I'm just going to take a crease brush and take this Spindrift shade in this darker color and work that in just to the inner corners. Just to darken it up just a tad. taking that same um, Northern Lights shade and just applying back any anything that was lost when one eye was blending. Just put that back in. I'm also going to re-wet that same brush, that top brush, with some setting spray. And I'm going to go in with Flurry. Same Elsa palette here with Flurry. This is a really chunky glitter. I'm just going to pat that in here with a little bit on my eye. The setting spray helps this to stay because it's, so, it's such a chunky glitter. Put a little bit on that one there. And take my e.l.f. charcoal liquid eyeliner and do this eye first. This is probably by far the easiest liquid eyeliner I've ever used, ever. Now yesterday I went in with the Spindrift color and went underneath my eye with that, like in my under eye, but I think today I'm going to try something a little bit different and just change it up a tad. So you can use the Spindrift color underneath your eye, it looks really good, and I'll, I'll post pictures afterwards. Um, or you can, I'm going to try this blue and see how that works out. So that's what I'm going to go in for. And that blue shade is called Winter. I'm just going to take some black eyeliner with a flat angle blush. Just gonna line. I'm gonna line my eye here.
Okay, then I'm gonna take my L'Oreal Telescopic Mascara. bronzer from Rimmel in the shade Deep Beige. I'm just going to apply a little bit in the creases of my cheeks. Rose blush. Put that on the apples of my cheeks. Then I'm going to take my e.l.f. Instant Brow Lift pencil in blonde. Last but not least, I'm going to take my Ofra lip liner in silk. Line my lips. And I'm going to take my Milani Pretty Natural. Lipstick. And put some of that on. All done, guys. Hope you like that. I hope it was quick and easy. But yeah, that's the look. Thanks for watching. I'm an awkward person.